We could just play some Chandelier. We could just play some Chandelier. Oh yeah, it'll be modded. Why do I feel like that's louder than it usually is? Hello? Oh, hello? I have to defeat the dragon? Attacking Nevermore Shrine? And I'm at Nevermore Hall? I have a 100 card singleton deck. Uh, oh, but I need my underground seed. Right. Is that a... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I need an underground C and I need an icy manipulator. Very shandy. Oh, don't attack me. No, I've had enough of you. It's all the way down there. Now that I have a 100 card deck, I mean, I would like to get this underground C and then we can start uh, chipping away at these castles. Why are you trying to attack me? A white amulet. Go back to Nevermore Hall? Sure. Look at how they part ways. Look at how they divide as I try to walk through. Uh, like, like Moses splitting the sea. I mean, I'll duel this creature. But I don't need this Black Lotus, but having a backup Black Lotus is kind of nice. Uh-oh. They put a living artifact on their Black Lotus. They immediately cast an Onulet. I too have an Onulet. Came home from Chicago and took apart my EDH deck to get parts for Canlander. That's what I'm talking about. Glad of it, knickknacks. Now you're on the path to enlightenment. You're casting a living artifact on Nox. Got it. I will play my own amulet. Did I turn it up for Goblin Polka? Probably. I forgot to make the Goblin Polka alert. Hello, Father Wheeler. And a merry uh, wheelering to you, too. How are you doing? Go block. Ooh, you'll love to see it. Merry Sunday. I was telling uh key for this on sundays now that i have the morning stream go play a Sarah angel here now that i have the morning stream uh going morning stream into streaming at home i'm so, i'm so tired i'm I'm the, I'm the most tired man you've ever met i think it's because typically you know, I'm getting up in the morning. It's Sunday morning. Today, especially with the uh, daylight savings time. You know, it's a uh, little tricky. But... Yeah, you take that and then I'll pass. Um, it, uh... I, I, like, don't eat in the morning because I rush to get out of the door. And then I do the stream. I eat too much. And then I'm like, great, now time to stream. And I'm just kind of sitting there being like, oh, I don't want to stream. Please don't make me stream yet. My stummy. Uh, I think I can afford to play this force field. Get it out of my hand. And then I can alabaster potion if they try to fireball my Sarah Angel. So I don't know what they're doing. Give me some soft serve. I mean... That's that sounds pretty good. All right, well, time walk is also pretty good. I cast this time walk. I'm gonna cast a wheel of fortune. Oh, I see. Fox sapphire. I did not draw a green source or a black source. Hey. 
I'm just gonna smash. I'm gonna throw down a Kismet. A lot of blue mana. Maybe I need to play some different lands here. Uh, I'll keep up with your soul. Vanilla, chocolate, or twist cone? I'm a big fan of the twist. You are... I'm a regular chubby checker. Um, I'm not fine with that. Oh, right on time. Soul ring? Yeah, like maybe this desert should just be a land with a land type. I mean, I guess desert does. It's it's desert now, but you know. Um, yeah, I I'm a big fan of vanilla as a flavor. Um, that's why they call me the Canadian Nick Weiger. Oh, don't hide, don't hide the angel. Don't want to hide the angel. It's pretty important. Kind of kills them. Oh. Well, the, speaking of. Bash. Inferno. Oh! They hit me with the healing self. No. Fuck. They hit me with the healing salve. Oh. Healing salve lethal. Oh, and they have the disenchant. If I lose this, I'm going to be really upset. Really upset. I need a black source. Uh, Phantom Monster is a pretty good magic card. Then why didn't you say anything if you saw it coming? So, I'm Superstar. Welcome back for the 18th month. This sun is barely legal because it's purchased with questionable funds. Huh? Uh, thank you for the sport. How you doing? How you been? Glad to have you, and may I say good to see you. You know, I ate too much salami earlier today. Also, Shane Lee Attack, apologies. I missed you for the 35th month. Uh, a little Sunday shandy. Don't mind if I do. Glad, glad I could help. Glad I could provide. There we go. You got one card in your hand. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna mind twist you. Uh, contract. Ooh. Oh, not actually the best collection of cards. Felwar Stone is kind of nice. Uh, because it lets me now have access to a bunch of green if I want. They cast Earthquake. They cast Earthquake for what? Oh, yeah, there you go. Phantasmal Forces. This card's a beating. Four mana, four one flyer. You just have to play blue on your upkeep. Hit me with that earthquake, I dare you. What is this deck? Oh my God, I'm gonna lose this. I can feel it. It's gonna happen. There's so many counters on these living artifacts. All right, I'm stopping this here. Divine offering on this. That made the howling line. No, they have fireballs. I don't even need this black lotus. This was a backup black lotus. Now we're just drawing all the lands. We could draw a time twister. Our brain geyser got anteed. Which would be great here if we could have it. Maybe I should have kept that in my hand. I have enough mana now. Mahamadi! Let's go. This card can end games. And we can unsummon it, unsummon it to save it. Oh. 
Or I could just lightning bolt them. Oh, it changed art. Ooh, and the power sink? Clutched it out. Clutched it the fuck out. Never doubt on the kid. Never doubt on the kid. Don't know why vanilla is synonymous with plain, ordinary, boring. It's literally the seed pod of an exotic tropical fruit. Yeah, I, know, I don't know. I don't know why. It is... It's... I think many people see it as the default. As it's just really... It is really hard to dislike vanilla. You know? Especially because vanilla is also just one of those flavors that is used to accentuate the flavors of other things. Um, yeah, big, big vanilla guy. Excuse me? Oh, it's not under attack anymore? Or did I just lose? What? Did I lose the thing? I still don't entirely understand how Chandelier works half the time. Oh, it, it got orbed icy. You have icy. Really need to find an icy manipulator and an underground sea. Not an infernal Medusa. Oh, I didn't mean to run into you. Oh. What? Get in there. Kudzu? Trade green amulet for blue card. I just used my green amulet. Oh, three of them. Yeah, I was fucked in Uh, defeat the Altakesh. I can do that. I wish Wingus and Dingus over here would stop following me. The Zephyr Haven? Where's the Altakesh? Hello? I need the Altakesh. There's the Altakesh. Ooh, I should have saved that uh, Yeah, I uh, I don't have a choice. The mana base in this deck is sus. I need a gem bazaar is what I need. A bog imp? I'll remove soul the bog imp. Where we going? Kismet on you. This guy will give me a bazaar. I hope. God, I hope. Hey, I'm trying to move my hand over here. Casting a wall of ice. And a vampire bat? Nope. Or Spike the vampire bat. Got him. Uh, this balance is looking worse and worse. Could really use a second white source. Untamed Wilds. Maybe I should have Untamed Wilds in this deck. Uh, I don't really want to play this Phantasmal Forces. I could balance here. Wraths are bored. I have to discard two cards. They lose a land. Their board's not really doing anything. I can just wait. I guess the reason to balance is because then I can play a Phantasmal Forces after. They're, they're not doing anything. Now I can... Now we can jam. I am discarding a couple of cards here, but Mind Twist, Divine Offering. I probably don't need a monster potion in this game. They lose some lands, they lose their board. I pitch these cards that I'm not casting and haven't been casting. The Ocean Soldier is likely just going to get blocked a bunch, but the Phantasmal Forces can... Oh. Boom. 
yeah, I want to pay upkeep costs. Or Crunch. The ocean Soldier. Nice swamps, friend. Pay the cost. And we're gonna have Triclethal. Unbelievable. Unbanned Balance and Commander? Yeah, coming up. Coming right up. Totally fair card. But a fair and reasonable card. Ooh. I don't mind if I do. Did not get the, the gem bazaar, but I did get a green amulet, which means I get a blue card, which means I can finally grab the underground sea that we gave away as a part of a quest or something. Now all I need is that look in your eyes. So underground sea. I feel like I wanna, I don't like desert. I think desert is a bit too much. It's a little extra. I might end up changing my tune on this. And we could probably cut an island and add a, a forest. I think so. Sorry I ruined. Ramadan starts tonight. Hey, sorry I ruined Ramadan for everyone again. I didn't ruin Ramadan this year, right? Please, I can't keep doing this. There's just no way. Twigo, welcome to the stream. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for joining us. I just did right now. Did Wheeler ruin Ramadan? This is so fucked up. This is so fucked up. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. I have nothing but respect for our Muslim brothers and sisters. I did, this is so fucked up. I'm, I I don't know how I did it again. Two years in a row, baby. <laughs> Two years in a row. Well, I don't even I don't even remember what the bit was. Maybe I said something. I give I get a mana link. Take a black enchantment east to the Pyrenean Glade. Yeah, absolutely. I don't even think I'm playing any black enchantments in my deck. 2022. Oh, it was in 2022. Oh, this is so this this is three years in a row that I've ruined Ramadan. Uh, yeah, give me some gold. I don't want to fight you. I just want to. I just want to get an icy manipulator. Oh, I could really go for like a. I'm not a big fan of slushies, but I could really go for a slushie. No, I said it. I said icy, and then I think there's some places that call slushies icies. I think really what I want to do is uh, I haven't been to the movies in a hot minute. Yeah, I know. I'm fucking going there, bud. I'm trying to get there. Wait, I got a mana link and then I fucked up? That's it, I gotta end some of this. I gotta, we gotta start killing people. Where's the green, green castle? You're on my, you're on my list here, bud. You're on my list. I gotta, I gotta... I gotta go to the green castle. You gonna get the dune worm popcorn bucket? I have not watched dune. I have not watched dune. The only thing I'm doing is playing Shondala. I need to see Dune 1. Oh, fuck. I don't think you need to see Dune to ask for the bucket. Yeah, but it would feel like stolen valor. Can you start with a bop? I can't exactly go see Dune and, you know, confident. I can't go to the movies. I forgot to click. Fuck. 
I can't, I've, I've gone tilt. I can't just waltz into the movie theater and be like, hello, I'd like this popcorn bucket. They'll be able to smell the fact that I have not um, watched the movie. They'll know. What is this start? Strut it instead. One fucking bucket, please. Extra butter. What's the deal with the bucket? So there's a dune pop, you know, those like novelty popcorn buckets. It's one of those for uh, dune two. Uh, doing two chicks at the same time. And it is supposed to resemble a sandworm, like the, the mouth of the, the sandworm. Um, and it, it naturally people are going to be like, I want to have sex with that popcorn bucket. As we all do, as you know, classic, right? It's a bad attack. Worst case scenario, I can cut a hole in the bottom of your popcorn bag like our ancestors have done for decades. <laughs> and damn what, just jerk off with it? This is getting very blue. Life was hard on the frontiers. It was tough. It was tough for all of us, you know. Anyway, so I'm going to attack you with my air elemental. I'm going to cast Inferno. Hopefully it works out. Uh, oh, they just protected themselves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. They life laced my Inferno. <laughs> that was pretty scary. I get this one. Back. I don't know. I I I should watch I should watch Dune. I'm sure I'd enjoy it. Um, if I want to see a movie, I did see that uh, End of Evangelion was going to be back into theaters on like the 17th to the 20th or something like that. And that looked really appealing. Ooh. Can't believe Homestuck was right. You don't have to say that. You don't have to agree with that. Oh, I think I have to do this. Homestuck's interesting. It's it's the it's a kind of thing where I was aware that it was going on in the background. But thankfully, my type of autism never really stuck to it. And so I just don't I don't know anything about it other than uh I find the drawings to be um kind of shit and from what I've read it was not very funny or interesting. Homestuck isn't interesting, actually. Sure. <laughs> I mean, you could tell me it was, uh, you could tell me it, it's the most interesting thing you've read. Uh, I'd believe you. I don't think I could get into it. Uh, you could tell me that it's, uh, poo poo not good. And I'd probably still believe you. Starting with a Mahamadi, if I can dodge. I mean, I don't think I can dodge anything, so I'm gonna at least fight this beat boy. Getting with it. Yeah, I got nothing wrong with it. I mean, who cares? It's it's a thing. It's a it's a it's a piece of work. Okay. I'm gonna contract 
My hand is stacked, but I have zero lands. Hello? Spaff TV, welcome uh, to the stream. Thank you for subscribing and supporting the channel. That means a lot to me. Oh, because I clicked the go to discard, it just skips through, even though I had to take another game action. Interesting. I learn more about Shondalar every day. I know that that's just a lyric from the Caillou theme song, but it's true. Let's go, my boy. Uh, probably not going to end the stream of life. First thing I hear tuning in is Homestuck Discourse. Hell yeah. $20 guy slash German North Tree Kodama sign guy. Hey, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Let's fucking go. Easily the hardest thing, the coldest maneuver. Uh, somebody has pulled at one of these events. It was that. Uh, it was a pleasure. Absolutely, absolutely a pleasure. <laughs> Thank you for supporting the channel. You helped more than you'll ever know. All right, Mahamadi. Howling mind. Starting with a howling mind's not bad. If I can find this damn wizard. Uh, Swamp Pod. Alright, well. Force Field. There's the green wizard. Uh, I could probably fight an Ape Lord to not start with Force Field in play. I think I want to do that. Like, even if this is just increasing my starting life total, I think I prefer that. Let's fight this Ape Lord. Down with the North Tree? Uh, it's the best. Mm. This hand's pretty good. <clears throat> Does the Green Wizard smoke green? The Green Wizard smokes that loud. Demonic Tutor, I will find a Black Lotus. I will play an island. I will play the Black Lotus. I am going to crack this for three blue. I'm going to move my hand over here. I'm going to cast Time Walk. I'm going to move my hand over here. Because I'm floating man. Time Walk and then cast Phantom Monster. I'm going to move my hand back over here. Take this extra turn. Uh, honestly, I might just cash in this Brain Geyser to draw two cards. Maybe I can wait. Yeah, North Tree... North Tree saw legitimate, like, type 2, like, standard legal play. Like, North Tree was, was a real magic card. Oh, um, I'm gonna Brain Geyser myself. Yeah, North Tree was dope. You just couldn't kill it without Wrath of God. Like, that's huge. Troll Ascetic couldn't kill it. Um, Bayloth had rotated. Uh-oh. Well, I have Force Field, actually, so... Uh, your puny worm can kick rocks. I am going to pop off a, a Time Twister here, though. My name is Dookie. Oh. Alright, well... Mm. Cast a time walk. Uh, I'm not going to swords, actually. Play a library of Alexandria. I'm going to cast a demonic tutor. I'm going to find Wrath of God. Uh, and then I'm just going to pass. Presumably they're going to Craw Worm and then play out some other cards. 
activate force field on the six green. Yeah, that card ruled. Kodama is so big, you couldn't GTA against it. I mean, you could by making your own thing bigger, but like... Oh yeah, just play all these cards out. Alright, I got my win condition online. I think that to me, so this is one of these stream ideas I've had that is like very cool to me and probably me alone is just looking at old like standard decks because they kind of rule. Like there's something really appealing about it. Uh... Like just, I mean, you, you could look through the the era that you're, you know, personally nostalgic. For. Oh, not there. Where? And like, I imagine that's where we'll start. But it's like, it's really cool to me to talk about these periods of standard uh, in the past, or like even extended or whatever. Because I don't know, that's kind of history that's lost to the ages. If I asked you. People, people that did not play during that era, right? People, folks that did not play during that era. If I asked you what decks were good in Mirrodin Kamigawa block, sta like era standard, w would you be able to answer? I'll, I said good. I mean, it could also, it would also be fun because it might be able to kind of dispel certain misconceptions where like there are decks and strategies that are kind of like, no, they're notable because they spiked one tournament or they, uh, ha they play in a very unique way or there's a cool, there's history associated with it or whatever. Um, but then in actuality, like... Was whatever like it was fine i'm not saying owling mind wasn't good at that tournament it was very good at that tournament but you know it was just one of those things uh it feels like i have a, a real hate on for uh owling mind. mono white mono white what oh the like uh mono white aggro for what it's worth, Owling Mine was uh, Kamigawa Ravnica when it showed up. Mono White was okay. It wasn't even that good of a deck. Uh, but you could play it, which is still interesting. Like, I'm not just talking about tier one decks. It's kind of cool to, to look back at those as well. Ooh, big stream of life gamer. Oh. I'm over. But like, yeah, who here, who here knew about, uh, the like blue green troll ascetic Umezawa's Jite deck? I don't even know what to call it. It was like blue green Maloku troll ascetic Kodama of the North Tree. Um... Oh, what else did you play? There was some other kind of hot stuff in there. I think you played some uh, Kegas. I was in kindergarten. Echoing Courage, if you're a baller, that's what I'm fucking talking about. It's a Paul. That, yes, Echoing Courage on your Maloku tokens. Sheesh. <laughs> Take a million. That's that good good. Also, we get to do the funny, uh, check out these cards I drew with Sylvan Library, but I also drew stuff during my turn. Yeah, I hear you, Bubba. Yeah, I'm here. Yeah, I'm here. Owling mine. 
That's just GTA and trash. Eh, I mean, it was one of the few decks that actually played GTAs in the main. GTA is kind of a funny card. Uh, there's a lot of decks in that era. There's not a huge amount of GTAs actually running around, certainly in the main decks, um, in that era, because you were kind of forced into not playing GTA. You know, like it's like GTA kind of pulled a flame tongue Kavu where you're like, wow, I'm surprised GTA wasn't everywhere. And it's like, well, because decks had to be built in such a way that they didn't get goozled by, by GTA. And so you have cards like Troll Ascetic or Kodama or big dragons that don't care or uh, the control decks, uh, like just like the Wrath decks and the Tron decks or whatever. Uh, let's get back big jugs, shall we? Oh, I should have uh, library. Oops. Top and gifts, ungiven sweetness. Yeah, that's the greater good decks. Ooh, I'm gonna steal that elf. Oh, I forgot to collect the draw cards. Whoops. Ooh, whoops. Play a mountain. Draw with library. Play control magic. Steal your land worms. Uh, play a Felden's game. I, how is the draft going? Oh, this is not draft. This is a uh, Chandelar. Also, did somebody ask how anti works? Okay, it was explained. Great, good, great and good. This matchup is taking fucking forever. How many cards are left in your deck? 32? Wait, what? 32. How many cards in your graveyard? One, two, three, four. Okay, interesting. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Ooh. All right, we can now actually kill them. Attack with land where else. Uh, what? Why can't I? Oh, because they control. Is fire breathing not creatures? Oh, no, right. It's old school templating. Uh, of course it is, right. I don't know why I thought it wouldn't be. Time walk. Sarah Angel. Uh, I'm going to... Do I have enough blue to do this? I don't. I was going to boomerang my own control magic and then control magic their killer bees. I still might do that at some point in time. I'm, I would... Cancel. I don't want to boomerang. Yeah, I'm here, Mulder. Didn't Sylvan Library, that's fine. Here's a single vampire. How's Shondalar Highlander going? The deck is slow. You're casting a fireball for nine? Oh, and you're dividing it. God damn, this deck is slow. Uh, yeah, give me all this. Wait, this is how you'd arrange it? Oh my god. Wow, 
Finally, I have a way to actually kill them. Uh, Fox Pearl. Mind Twit. No, not for a 17. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Gonna Mind Twist them for two. Uh, for three? Sure, why not? You know what, I'm gonna mana burn for the bunch. I don't I don't give a shit. I lose nine to mana burn. <laughs> Just get me out of this fucking game. A Felwar stone? We can do better than that. Sarah Angel. That sounds like a good thing to start off with. That sounds pretty good. Twist for 17 is pretty funny. You have a Fungusaur. The Great Druid. Oh my god. Drop a honey. Is the AI going to understand Drop a Honey? Nope. Definitely not. Drop Honey is a messed up magic card. And Porphyry nodes. Like, it is an unreal magic card. <laughs> I cast another zero. Nice. Upkeep drop, honey. I'll just kill your three mana card for free. Kismet on this druid. Drop a honey, your elf. Hit you a Sarah Angel. Casting still energy. Oh, they're attacking. Sure, I'll take damage. Uh, I'm going to return your aspect of the earth so that my drop of honey kills your fungusaur. Oh, hold on. Uh, that's not what I wanted to tap. I, although it doesn't really matter. I'm going to regrowth my boomerang. And I'm going to boomerang my own drop of honey. And then I'm just going to hit you for four. Okay. Mind twist you for two. Hit you. You played Highlander with the Chicago Discord last night. We closed the LGS and ended up moving over to the adjoining bar to keep jamming. Hell yeah. First time one of our meetups has had enough people to have more than one game going at once for longer than two hours. Sick. Shivan Dragon is the best creature in this game in terms of like speed running and whatnot, but it costs a lot of mana. All right, we got three green cards. We did it, chat. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't... I don't think I want any of these cards. What's Rebirth do again? Ugh. I 
mean, I'll take I'll take backup dual lands. Like, I don't know if I'm really changing my deck anytime soon. Could take Pixie Queens. Or Pixie Queen. It's got really good art. Wayuli Wolf. A War Mammoth. Tracker's kind of cool. Huh? Oh. Could take Moss Monster. Horned Cobra. Sure, why not? I don't know. All right, one castle down. Anybody want to go to White Castle and get a cheesy sack? Actually, hold up. We hit the, like, jackpot for RNG this uh, run. So typically when you are speedrunning this game, you want, there's, like, different layouts for the castles. This is, like, the jackpot layout. Because you get the cat green castle into red castle into black castle, and you just have to go to white castle after. Like that's that's dope. That that's pretty cool. Obviously, it doesn't do anything for us here, but do not tempt me. I'm less than a mile away from the white castle. I mean, if you're in Chicago. I enjoyed White Castle, although Evermore Shrine. Okay, I enjoyed White Castle, although I gotta tell ya, Evermore Shrine. Oh, it's all the way over there. I gotta tell ya, I don't think you need as many of those burgers as they lead you to believe. I I think you only need two. We as a nation have been misled. I would like 30 goddamn tiny burgers, but they're not even that small. They're like totally reasonable size. There's no, but they're like not that bad. They are bigger than you would expect, honey. They are bigger than you would expect. But we want a lot. Uh, well. How, ma how many do you need? As we generate diabolic machine. Steam machine. Mm, I guess I'll fight you. A Brothers of Fire? Oh no, that's a good magic card. Magnetic Mountain? Hold on. Blue creatures do not untap during their controller's untap set. For each blue creature, a player controls and may pay an additional four in their upkeep on I got it. Here's my big jugs. Look, I, I'm a fat guy, and even I look at the amount of white castle sliders that you go, I, I, you don't need that much. You don't need that much. <clears throat> Hi, call me Rusty. What up? How you doing? Welcome back for the 37th month. Okay, but when is Shondalar coming to Arena? We can only hope fairly soon. You better believe I'm divine awful, you brass man. I'm shoving. I'm shoving for lethal. Phantom Monster. You're playing Magnetic Mountain? Hold on. Your Phantom Monster deck and Magnetic Mountain? That's that's wild. That should be illegal. K 
Okay, the wizard is not here. Have you guys tried the Forge Chandelier remake? No, I've heard about it though. Starting with a soul ring. There's the wizard. Soul ring's good, but I need... Papa needs a Mahamadi. Or... No, not a Felden's Cane. No. I know somebody who can eat six triple triples. Triple triple. What's a triple triple? Sure, I'll start with Felwar's down. Gambledon yeah, lost. <laughs> the Billy Gun? William's Gun? Felden's Cane uh, shuffles your uh, graveyard back into your deck. In Canada, if you tell someone, uh, you mention a double double, that's a uh, Timmy Tim Hortons thing. Three oh, like a three by three. Oh, you're casting a Windsor change, huh? All right. Same applies to the triple triple. I mean, if you're getting a triple triple. Why are you winds of changing again? I'm gonna counter this. Get this shit out of here. Did you just not draw a land? You did this to yourself. I swear to God, if you winds of change a third time. <clears throat> oh. Turn that to your hand. Oh, I'll cut track from below. Anti my control magic. Oh. Uh one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm gonna demonic tutor here. Find like an air elemental. I guess. Are you listening to Inda Club? Look at a Mahamadi. Are you listening to Inda Club? Nice. That's all. I'll play Tim. Find me in the club. Oh yeah, Magnetic Mountain. Fuck. Well, I could pay four in the Mahamadi. That's why I said Sarah Angel first. Um, oh, this is so funny. So remove soul. It says counter target summon spell. And if you look at this, uh, are you going to show me? Summon Jin, right? Summon. But artifact creatures are just artifact creature. They're not summons. So that's why... Fuck. <laughs> I wanted to counter it. But that's why remove soul wouldn't counter it, but counter spell would. So stupid. Yeah, it's great. Get in there, Mahamadi. Yeah, it's a robot. There's no soul. Remove soul. The bird of paradise.
Untap the long body. Get in there. Ooh, on you lit. They should have eradicated it to counter non artifact creatures. That's, yeah, you know what? Yeah! I'm sick and tired of people remove souling my uh, walking ballista. Uh, I should have done this last turn, but I'm doing it now. Oh my god, I can disenchant their. Wait, no, I can't. I don't have a white source. I was gonna, like, I could disenchant the magnetic mountain. Wish I was a little bit taller. Wish I was a baller. Hello? 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 Onulet, get in there. Don't be scared. Abe, don't be scared. Oh, you motherfucker. Ah, uh, it's fine. It, I, I just realized it tapped me out of blue. I tapped me out of blue. Chandelar, why are you so crunchy right now? Red wizard down. Mm, do we have a dragon? I don't have a dragon. I want a dragon. Also kind of want a ruck egg. Curious, because I want to see what the token looks like. Uh, Granite Gargoyle is also just like a reasonable magic card. Or no, Sedge Troll. Sedge Troll is, this card is actually good. Uh, and then I can just get like a backup. Badlands? Oh, I don't know. I might actually add some of them to my deck. Okay. <clears throat> On to the Black Castle. Get this Pope away from me. Yeah, enter the castle. Watch out, everybody. Gloom is in effect. Actually, hold up. That, that's not good for me. Start with the Mox Jet. Mandibolt. Oh, this, this hand stinks. Never mind, this hand's great. Turn one phantasmal monster or forces. I'm going to pay the costs to be the boss. Yeah, please don't. Don't get it too close to the mic. I should have maybe taken this terror out of my deck, huh? Drudge skellies. All right, not bad. Smash. Unholy strength from the Drudge skellies and holy strength. Wait, what? You put gloom in here? Why, why does this have white and black cards? And there's a gloom afoot. No, I have a lightning bolt. Yeah, I've got basically everything you could want. 
There was a game plan for that. Drop a honey, really good against vamp bats. Oh, I have a forest. Holy shit. Should have played it. Oh. No, I don't have a forest. And if they don't play another creature here, I'm on a five color deck. I've never seen the graphics of this game. Something it's it's awfully special, huh? It's pretty incredible. I guess this Wrath of God isn't getting cast until turn uh, a billion. Like they raised at the bat. Gonna give myself another copy of Howling Mine. Play out this. Bad Moon. Bad Moon to Zombie Master. Sick. Um. Play a trike. Oh, cosmic horror. Okay, we def definitely need to find another white source. Please move the spell chain out of the way. Can you play exit? No, you can't play exit. This. Dark ritual scathe the zombies. Okay. We need the second white. Oh, that's the second white. Big old moat. I don't think this deck can actually beat moat. Uh, vampire bats. Oh. Drain life can also do it. I guess. I'll take this extra turn. Why, yeah, I have the jet, right? I was like, oh, I can just cast the sink here. It's pretty good. Got a time walk going. Um, I could have maybe time twister there. Ooh. Put you for five in the air. And then mind twist you for six. I, didn't, I shouldn't have tapped that red. They're just going to draw three cards in their next turn, but... Green life. A bunch of cards that are not real. Okay, go. I've got a power sink, though. And they're just going to keep paying the upkeep for Cosmic Core. We're playing against a Necromancer. Their deck is genuinely... Uh, Pretty good. Where's damnation? I'm going to help a lot of future questions you might have, Moon Slifer. Um, I guess before I assist you in your future questions, allow me to ask you a question. And I mean this in, in as uh, sincere a way possible. Uh, what do you think Shondalar is? Like what? As far as this game is, what 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 do you think we're doing right now? Because this is. Did you just alabaster potion for zero? You motherfucker, Shandy Landy. April first moto should skin like this. That'd be great. Because this isn't exactly Magic the Gathering. 
certainly not i mean it is it quite literally is that's the name of the game um but maybe not the one you're thinking yeah this this came out in 1995 97 uh i thought this one i thought it was 95 Oh, it's 97. Hmm. Uh, yeah, you can call it before. I'm not just sure what cards are available. All the old ones. Basically, yeah. cards from... Well, from 1997. You can have a skate zombies. God bless Moat. Yeah, and took Antiquities is the last one. That's very funny. We got a Phantasmal Forces. Uh, not the best at beginning the game with. Doesn't help that this game is older than you. Yeah, exactly. It's, uh... Ha! Wait, what? I can't pay the upkeep cost, so I lose my Phantasmal Forces. But we traded. We we got rid of their carrying ants. As a 24-year-old, it's hard to parse which old-ass cards are older than that or not. Yeah, that's true. This is the beauty of magic, is that it's a game that pulls everybody together uh, no matter the age. There are people in this chat right now that have been alive for less time than I have played Magic the Gathering. Right? And I'm not uh, exactly old. Fungus. Well, now I feel like an idiot for using control magic on this. Why is there a fungus or in the Black Castle? Uh, let's onulate. Oh, right. Fungus for damage. Well, you can take the damage. That's fine. I thought this was the other way around, the, the monolith. In my head, it was like this redirects damage from you to creatures. Which could be actually pretty good. I forgot to Tim. Eh, it's fine. Damage prevention? Why? No, I'm not going to Alabaster Potion them. But I am going to Time Twister. No, it just, it just went through my turn, all right? Twister. I didn't draw the lightning bolt. Game's over. My life is over. Stream of life. Jesus. Mm -hmm. 
A second phantasmal? Wait, a second phantasmal forces? How is that possible? What? Oh, it's because I had one die. The one the game... <laughs> there's the one that the game started me off with, and then there's the one that's actually in my deck. You are at five life activating greed? Oh, that's kind of hot. I started playing Magic the Gathering in Torment, which came out in 2000, it was a 2001, 2002? Torment, MTG. Uh, February 4th, I mean, it came out February 4th, 2002, but that would have been spring break 2022 is when I, or 2002 is when I started. Spring break. If I can get another dice. Oh, I fucking just, I overshot. Whoops. Oh, did I take the mulligan? I took the mulligan, right? Okay, great. Uh, I've never been so upset to see Ancestral Recall. Sengir Vampire will at least be able to block. Kinda. Uh, I can't block you. But I can race them. Erg Raiders. Mind twist you. Elden's cane, huh? Sick. Anyways, here's a jade statue. And I'm going to double block. I guess I could have played the cane. We have stopped the carrion ants from attacking. Beautiful. I can divine offering this on you. Carrion ants is like actually a pretty messed up magic card. I mean, it's just a shade, right? Um, in fact, yeah, it's just a shape. But this card just, if you don't have an answer for it, it's one of those cards that'll kill you. Uh, I kind of just want a Divine Offering and Onulet here. They, they, they cost so much mana under Gloom. Oh, hold on. I shouldn't be doing this. Uh, Yeah, it's probably fine. Whatever. Stream of life for a bunch. Frozen Shade requiring a single black is uh, a bit of a oofa doofa, though. Got a second carry in ants? You just happy to see me. Oh, that's a good magic card. Hey, what? Hey, what? You're not allowed to do that. Oh, yeah. Give me that seven mana Sarah Angel. Or eight mana Sari. Eight mana four four flyer. What is this? Archangel? Am I okay with being called Ben? Uh yeah, that's fine. It is after all my name. I mean, Wheeler is probably better. Uh, because you know it's consistent. But it's not 
I, uh, do, yeah, doesn't matter. Uh, I will... And I guess I'll trade for the Sengir Vampire. Spirit Link on my Sengir Vampire is a bit of a pisser. Oh, and you tap my blue. Interesting. I mean, I'm not really force biking much at this point. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, hold on. Then I can Jade Statue. What do you mean an illegal block? Hello? Is Jade Statue just bugged in this game? Am I only just finding this out now? I mean, I knew Jade Statue was bugged in a different way. Yeah, I'm just gonna die to be scary and answer if I can't draw a creature. That's a creature. Spirit link on big jugs. Oh, I can block you. Hold on, hold on. Uh, let me Felden's game myself. I have so many goodies. That is not one of them. Absolutely wrecked. I didn't actually mean to fight them anyways, but that took a long time. The power of carrying ants. Uh, yeah, I'll fight another one. Maybe I should fight the Crusader. They don't start with carrying ants. Ooh, this hand though. Do I have in mind how I'm going to build my Shondalar deck? Uh, I did have a stipulation for building my deck, but thankfully I've already succeeded that. So my deck is 100 cards singleton, meaning that I'm only playing one of any individual card. There are no duplicates. Uh, I'm play... Oh, I have a Yoshin Soldier. I could have played the Yoshin Soldier. There's a Juggernaut. This carrion ants is going to make me use a retired turn. And it's a little bit scarier. Also, Yoshin Soldier can just block. Yeah, I'm basically playing a commander deck. My commander is. Uh, not here. Four mana Spirit Link. Let's go. I knew I would be happy with putting Yoshin Soldier in this deck. <sighs> Prof invites me back on to uh, Shuffle Up and Play. I'm excited. I had a great time last time. And then all of a sudden I'm getting bullied. Jade Monolith. Uh, that's really good here. I bet I can goozle. Them. Yeah, I can goozle. Them. And I'm Mulder. Yeah. 
I, stri I stripped their only available land uh, so that they couldn't Jade Monolith because the AI does not want a mana burn. Which is pretty funny. Yeah, yeah, no, it was a ton of fun. It was the perfect... As the person that is usually razzing someone, it's always nicer when uh, other people join in on the razzing, especially when, you know, it's it's a friend. Well, usually that's when it is. Oh, greed is so good. Please just keep activating greed. <laughs> Put a spirit link on there, Zengir Vampire. Hey, I did that. Yeah, I did that first. Here's our alcohol. I need a time twister or a wheel of fortune or a brain geyser or a demonic tutor. I can tear that. I mean, I could if I had black mana. A Felden's cane? Are all the Highlander decks that used mine? Uh, no. Would you giant growth? You giant growth. Holy shit. No, I brought uh, my own deck, obviously. And, uh, oh, that's such a good draw. I, bu I brought my own deck uh, as well as um, the deck that uh, Prof played. Okay. I didn't actually want Falcon's game. Okay, well that actually gives me black mana, so now I can tear like a fungus or something. Or a angel? Jesus. Go play like a play like an unholy strength or something, or a spirit link. A second syringe. Let's go on you lit. They've drawn so many more cards than me. This is kind of rough. I need like a draw seven, a fireball. Oh, that's not really good enough, but sure, I'll mind twist you for six. Sick. Glad I did that. All right, this is it. Unfucking believable. Unbelievable. I think I need to cut that. Uh, let's, let's cut this Felton's game. I mean, maybe it's actually fine. I just need more cards. I think I just need more cards that do things. Uh, I thought about playing Canlander, but I don't want to spend much of their decks that are cheap. My budget would be around 100 and 150. You could build a mono red aggro deck at that amount or goblins and that would be totally cool and fine um you are still gonna have to make certain you know sacrifices in deck building but ultimately you could build that deck and kill people big red might be a bit tough because that's a deck that really benefits from a lot of fast mana and so 
while the individual cards might not be that expensive you i mean you could probably do it, it, it yeah I'd like soul ring and stuff and your point spread 100 to 150 is not a huge amount to work with uh in the you know considering the cost of your average highlander deck Dark Ritual to carry an ants. Uh, this is just for the next fight. Ooh, enemy dead on the carry an ants. You love to see it. Hey, wait a minute. That didn't give the carrying ants minus one, minus zero. That's kind of interesting. Is it because it's already at zero and it's like, can't go any lower? Ah, sorry, boss. Can't go any lower. Belwar stone. Uh, you could use Soul Ring. I mean, do you have a mana crypt? Do you have a mana vault? It also depends on like what cards do you already own, right? Like, you have a budget from a hundred to hundred and fifty dollars. Do you own any of these cards? Like, are some of these cards going to be able to shape a lot? Do you play Commander? Do you have like a uh, like a, a, a strip mine or a wasteland or or a mana vault, a mana crypt, an ancient tomb, you know, stuff that might show up in those formats or that you might have gotten in packs or whatever. I mean, you're probably not getting some of those in packs, but, you know, who knows? I think this is from before how they, ch yeah, they changed the, the negatives. Bought the cool Boros Anthem. Oh yeah, I picked up a copy of one of those as well. I picked up, I mean, we had one Chili in the Moon base, and I need it because we're recording North 100 Showdown, a Canadian Highlander Throwdown, tomorrow. Vamp. Gotta sing, gotta sing Gear Vampire. Yeah, you do. Yeah, also, people just don't care if you play with foxes or not. Canlander is one of those formats where nobody gives a shit if you're playing with proxies. And if they do, well, you can tell them I told them to fuck off. Hmm? Elder Land. I don't even know what I got. Don't even know what I got. Won't even tell me. Oh shit, I had veggie soup on the burner. Hold on one sec.
All right, it's fine. I had the burner down very low. I had, there's this veggie soup that I found online that has uh, become something I like to keep in rotation. Just taste it. And it uses a lot of white wine. So you know it's good. Why this, why is this so abandoned? Where is everyone? They start with a hippie? Oh. Oh, library is so bad against hippie though. Never mind. I just have to hope they don't hit my twister. Soul ring, black lotus. On my island. They hit my twister. How the fuck do I beat this? And a turn one send your vampire. And Gloom is still active. And I lost my swamp. I can't even, like, hope to draw Wrath. A second send me vampire. Alright, I'm dead. Holy shit. Oh, what? I didn't even want to walk. Ready to quit? Thinking about it. Yeah, thinking about it. Mm -hmm. Sylvan Library. The gloom is extra bad because the white cards are basically how we survive. You know? Oh, I should have drawn. Uh, I don't think I'm winning this one either. Like I need the amount of spot removal we have is is so low. It's pretty tough. Well, there's some blue mana. I can actually use... <laughs> I can disenchant. Oh, hold on. I might... Maybe I need to change my deck for this. I think I need to change my deck before this. Because terror doesn't do anything. I should maybe try to include, like, immolation. Do I ha- I don't even have an immolation. I just need more stuff that can actually deal with like carrion ants and hippie. Cyblast might not be doing it. We could bring him the said troll. We could also just go do the other castles first. 
fog might be kind of fun. What does the Pegasus need money for? I don't know, like Pegasus food, probably? The giant spider is just good enough. Has a huge ass. <clears throat> I have to fight you? My starting life total is also just lower now. Because I've been trying to like turbo through. Which is probably fine. A whirling dervish, eh? Oh, I didn't want you to tap my city brass. No. No. This isn't that bad. Wait, when do I do this? It's right, it's untapped step. Uh, I'm gonna bolt the on you look. A second on you that has hit the table okay. oh, I guess I can attack paralyze I mean attacking to on it uh paralyze is an under underrated card for sure on the last episode of Bylaw and Order, you mentioned Golgari Brownstone as a magic card. What card is that? No, I made a joke because uh, Kathleen said a Golgari Brownstone, and I meant go. And I said, "Isn't that a magic card?" Because there's a magic card called Golgari Brown Scale. You know, it works. Shivam is so high on pyrotechnics. What up? How you doing? It's five mana, dude. I'm dead by then. Oh, I got a warp artifact. All right, Mahamadi, get in here. Also, how are you doing, bud? But also, it's five mana. They start with the carrying ants in play. There's nothing I can do. Oh, I should have attacked with the ocean soldier. What? Oh, did I burn for one here? Shit. Eh, whatever. They're dead. Surely they're dead. Just 
Tortellini chowder? Oh, that sounds good. Thank you for the mock sapphire. All right, let's try this again. Okay, I'll save that. So I really need to find the wizard. Yeah, I've already got all the mocks in. The only card I really need that I don't own is an Icy Manipulator. And I just haven't found one. I haven't really had an opportunity. I thought I had one. Uh, when we got the, like, Hey, you uh, can pick one artifact card to have for free. And I was like, oh. Juggernaut. Toughness of two, Marsh Viper. Yeah, like, look at this shit. They start with the bats and they unholy strength it, and I'm fucked. <laughs> this glue is so hard. Because the ways, the only way that we, uh, and they fucking evil presence my mountain, I'm dead. Unlo I mean, next turn I can swords this bat, but. Because I drew the mox pro. Although they did give me a land for demonic press or demonic tutor. Man, fuck gloom in particular. Um. God, I don't know. Some way of killing you. Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune. Contract from below. Contract from below. Maybe I need Tranquility. I have a jam and removal. It just disenchant and disc and and all that. Um you know, contract. Hard set of cards to contract away. Oh. It's a pretty good card. My mana. The, honestly, the mana is the hardest part about this uh, run is uh because everything else is just kind of whatever like my card quality is pretty high albeit inconsistent at times like aggression is really tough for this deck to deal with and uh yeah that's it like if my mana lines up then we're we're cruising but my mana has to line up. Casting Ray's Dead on Cosmic Horror. What do you think they're going to discard? Discard the Space Zombies. Okay. Oh, they... Right. Forgot to pay. I mean, they're at 25. It's so hard for me to remember to ping. Anime Dead on the Scathe Zombies. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna cast land tax. I'm gonna ping this. I'm looking for a second blue. I haven't found it, but I got my time walk again. I guess Tundra is it? 
Tundra. Now we have Tundra and City. Okay, so we did get it. Never mind. Don't listen to me. Uh, no, I don't want Island Sanctuary. Oh, I want Jaded Statue. Holy shit. A 6 5 scathe zombies? Well, Juggernaut, you've done your job. Here's a moat. Man, old school magic sucks. It's just, all the cards are just based around telling your opponent they don't get to do something. It's kind of wild. It is such a it, it's such a a. Uh, uh, a pleasure getting to play with these old cards just if only for the perspective that it can give you right because people get nostalgic over this kind of thing myself included but it is it is miserable like what the hell is this what are we even doing here why are we here just to suffer and this shit's got to stop. most Buddhist game life is suffering now I don't know that much about Buddhism I'll be the first to say that but do you have to seek out suffering in the practices of Buddhism <laughs> or is it just accepting that suffering that you know life is suffering because this is something that you could avoid the suffering seeks you you could avoid this there's nothing in the rules. Just don't desire. Is that a skill issue or is that depression? Okay, so it's Catholic Buddhism. That's cursed. Catholic Buddhism just sounds like the religious version of like a Guy Fieri restaurant. It's text. It's the text wasabi of religion. <laughs> And you. This deck actually just might be better off playing like every creature that is reasonably on rate. Uh, I would recommend the Discord, and which uh, you can find a link through the website. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Have we sunk so low? Oh, I forgot to draw a card. Whoops. I mean, neither of these cards do anything. Oh, I should probably keep one of these cards in my hand, huh? Swords to plowshares. Oh, it costs that much mana. Yeah, I know what I'm drawing. I think I need to disc as like a last... Last... Last disc effort. Is that anything? Hello? Ooh, drop a honey. Real magic card alert. Real magic card alert. Then I should just start keeping cards in my hand, I guess, for this ivory tower. Or I could play this land tax and I could actually probably land tax them. Play a creature. All right, keep your secrets. Oh, okay. Good to know. Land tax these lands, Sylvan Library, then draw. Uh, put back this, put back this. Cast Time Walk. Take an extra turn, land tax. Plains, mountain. Forest. Draw, Sylvan Library. Oh, I forgot to put the card back, fuck. Well, I'm not casting either of these this turn anyways. Yoink. Mm, shouldn't have played the land because I get more life from it, but I'm going to mind twist you. Yeah, that's a good call. Insert disc two. Is there a new Final Fantasy came out, right? Uh, I don't have a way of attacking you, so I don't... Yes, and no. Oh, is it the? It's the remake, right? It's it's a new remake. It's a re. Sorry, it's a remake, but it has like a new storyline and everything. It's not like a proper remaster. It it actually does. Oh, I only found one. Fuck. I misclicked. It's a remake, but it's a whole new game. Because that's the number one game I think of when I'm like... <laughs> anytime people mention, like, insert disc 2. I'd like to draw eight. Any of these cards good? Wow, honestly not. Okay. 
Probably don't need this copy artifact. I have a confession to make though. Please don't take away my gamer card when I uh, mention this. I have never played Final Fantasy VII. Not once. Never played it. Didn't touch the stuff. Oh, hell yeah, mana burn. <clears throat> I did, however, play... Final Fantasy 9. Played a lot of Final Fantasy 9. Yeah, that game ruled. That was the good one on the PS1. 9 or 7? I really liked 9. I remember liking 9. I have never played Chrono Trigger. Honestly, you could go through this is actually a fun game. Just uh rattle off <laughs> rattle off iconic video games, like some of the best of all time. And uh chances are I have I forgot the library. Chances are I have just not played it. Get this gloom. I've never played. I've never played Coder. I know of Coder. Uh, I've the whole seven Nightfire. Don't even know what that is. I've listed the games I've beaten on Twitter. Yeah, but there are a lot of games that like that list is more like that I remember. I mean, some stuff I played as a kid. Like that list on there, I don't. Yes, I've played and beat Ocarina of Time. Ooh, the El Hajjaj Unholy Strength? Double Greed? Sick. I can finally end this game. Monkey Island? Nope. Super Mario RPG? Nope. I've never played Earthbound. Uh, oh, there's the wizard. I played Super Mario World. I played Super Mario 3 and 1. I've never played 2. Uh, God, I don't know. I've never played Banjo and Kazooie. I played Yoshi's Island. I played a lot of Yoshi's Island when I was a kid. Hey, I played Halo. Is that it? Is there no... Are there no... Is it just plus life? Plus life doesn't do anything in this matchup. I need to start with something in play. Bad RNG. Are big decks and medium decks the same? They're not. The medium decks are more like stompy decks from like Legacy and whatnot. Um, Alright, I guess I'll try it. Plus two life. They're going to start with a hippie. I, th I genuinely don't think I can beat them like that. So I think I have to actually try to get another dice. Can I explain Chandelar? So it's like a top-down kind of open world-ish game where you uh, get encounters and you play Magic the Gathering against them. Uh, it uses all old cards. Your deck is really bad. It breaks all the rules of the game. You're basically trying to stop these evil wizards from taking over. They have big castles. You defeat the four wizards in the castle. And then you can go and uh, fight the final boss. That's more or less the game. Uh, I guess I can play this land tax. 
I haven't played Kingdom Hearts. I think I own Kingdom Hearts. Oh shit, right. I can't cast that because of Gloom. No, fuck, fuck. Oh, I have to twist her now. I have to Phantasmal Forces now. I just mana burn full on. Shit. I, my buddy gave me his PS3 so I could play Demon Souls, the original one, uh, and some games and one of the games. One of the games is Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2, but I've never, never played them. Uh, I played Baldur's Gate Dark Leg- uh, no, not Dark Legacy, that's Gauntlet. I played Baldur's Alliance. Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. That's what I played. Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. I cast Bull Rush over and over again. That, the, what the fuck do I mean break the rules of the game? You know how you can only have one Black Lotus in your deck? Uh, well, what if you didn't? What if, and you know how you typically don't start the game with a four drop creature and a gloom in play? Well, sorry, fucker. Sorry, friend. Sorry, friend, but you're fucked. I have never played an F-Zero game in my life. I did play Gauntlet Dark Legacy. Yeah, there's just a lot of games I haven't played from that era. I, I mean, I, there are so many games. I didn't own a PlayStation. My buddy owned a PlayStation. But, uh, or no, I didn't own a PlayStation until later on. I owned a PlayStation when it was like, when the PS2 was like already announced. And they, the what is it? The, the PS, PSX, like the smaller rounded one was the one that I owned. I'll burn, or I'll, I'll take one off this. Okay, goodbye. So yeah, there's like a lot of games from that era that I just like never played because I, I didn't own. And then when my buddy got a PS2 and like I got a GameCube, then it was it was all over. Oh, anti ink trike is not great. Better up, better up, better up. I played Star Fox 64. I think playing a gauntlet game on like a uh, crossing the streams would be fun. Oh, I should have unsummoned motherfucker. I had the combo, the unsummon mind twist combo. Yeah, I played a lot of gauntlet 64. Oregon trail. Oh, I got so much dysentery. You wouldn't believe. Not to brag, but uh, yeah, I got a lot of dysentery. I played Roller Coaster Tycoon. Uh, played a lot of that. There was a game that I remember my sister got because Roller Coaster Tycoon was a little too like uh adult for her or she i i played the shit out of sim theme park that's what i played like i loved roller coaster tycoon but my sister got sim theme park and then i i ended up being like oh no this game's just better sim theme park was just so, so much easier to like just play for hours upon hours upon hours. Oh. Artillery duel for the ColecoVision. Oh. Yeah. 
I played a lot of Sim theme park. to fucking fight more of you? I gotta fight more of you nerds? I'd actually be curious on the list of like best games of all time how many of them I have not played. Like if, I don't know. Is there a good best games of all time list? One that isn't just like 100% clickbait? You won't believe the number one. No, yeah, I, mean, I guess by nature, the nature of those lists is just clickbait anyways. I haven't played Half-Life. I've played Half-Life 2, uh, but I didn't play it to completion. There's gotta be a better way of saying that. That just makes it sound like I, I just jorking it. I want someone to save some life. Uh, yeah, I played both the uh, GameCube Paper Mario. I played Paper Mario, the 64, and the Thousand Year Door. Mm, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I imagine a lot of them are, like, impressive in the context. Right? In the, in the, like, the time and place. Sim Theme Park is abandoned where? Then what the, what are we doing playing this new game? We could be playing Sim Theme Park. I know what I'm fucking doing. <laughs> I know what I'm doing after this. Parentheses going to bed. Ooh. Chat. <clears throat> okay, I need to grab a Wrath of God. Oh. Well. To avoid mana burn, I will put all of my ass into this mind twist. Also, for in dream life, that's not bad. What? Why? How did I mana burn? I lost. It didn't let me. I think I'm going to take a break from Shondalar after this. <laughs> oh, bad RNG. <sighs> or at least, I mean, I, I know that I actually am. I'd like to focus on doing some other games. Uh, other, and by that, I mean playing Magic the Gathering. Um, ooh, we start with a mock sapphire. Pretty cool. I'm going to demonic tutor for a black lotus. I never played your favorite game. I have not actually played a Civ game. I've never played a Civ game. I have Civ 6. Uh, somebody had like a Humble Bundle 
I think Sem had a Humble Bundle coupon. Uh, it was just like, I have this extra thing and these games, who wants it? I've never played a save game. I imagine I would like them because I played like Age of Empires when I was younger. And uh, I played a bit of Warcraft 3. I wasn't a gamer, but... Not the same? Oh, is it actually not the same? I don't actually know anything about... I always assumed Civ was like... I always assumed that it was... Uh, exactly like Warcraft. Did I ever have an MMO phase? Oh yeah, I played a lot of World of Warcraft. I played on a sponsored team for a while. And Kata use that to do that. Uh, but that those games are not health. It, no, absolutely not. I can't, can't even talk about playing those games. Like it's. An incredibly unhealthy relationship. Um, I can cast a Sangir Vampire, but I kind of want a Wrath of God. I'm going to cast a Sangir Vampire. Uh, yeah, I'm going to cast a Sangir Oh, you only have forests in play? Wrath of God. I don't, I don't give a shit. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Now you play a swamp. I'm gonna scream, dude. I'm I'm losing my I'm losing my fucking marbles here, dude. Turn based hex square. I don't even know what that means. None of those words are in the Bible. Actually, turn is certainly in there. Based is probably too. Somebody has got to say, hey, this Jesus guy is pretty based, huh? That's actually the biggest difference between um, the more modern form of Christianity and uh, Judaism is that um, while the Jewish people do believe that Jesus was a pretty all right guy, they do not believe that he was based. The double marks. I'm older. I'm older. Oh, right, you have pro black. Fucking whirling dervish. <sighs> yeah, that's fine. Riz is in the Bible. Hi, Mulder. King of Fighters. <laughs> the KOF boss. Mm -hmm. Give Mulder some pets. Right, I have to go shields down to do this. Ah, uh, what's the worst could, that could happen? The resurrection. On God, he came. <laughs> On God, I moved that boulder and there was nobody there. Hi. Loud Mulder. <laughs> Excuse me. This enemy has like I don't know how to describe it other than a deck that if you fought it against fought against it at F and M, you would be like, please for the love of God, don't let me lose to this. If I lose to this deck, I'm gonna go out and drink until I get sick. Like it is it's one, it's, haha! <laughs> so my objective is I put a bunch of uh, things that ping you in your upkeep and you're just like, 
Do you, how, like, what do you do against Goblin Balloon Brigade? You're just dead, right? And they're like, no. Uh, oh, I, I, they just, oh, fuck. I fucking death. <laughs> what do you, <laughs> what do you want from me? This is the most annoying thing to, oh, God damn it. I am so glad that you're dead. Yeah, hi, Mulder. Hi, Bubba. Yeah. Hum dum fiddle dee dee. Castle Necros can suck my ass. This place stinks. I hate this place. <laughs> Ooh, gloom in my vampire bat. Very cool. Extremely cool. I can't wait to disintegrate this bat. I want this whole bat's family dead. Hi. What? Yeah. Weakness kills bats? I'm playing 100 card singleton. Also, I think I'd play immolation because it also kills hippie. Yes, I know. All right. Well, on the plus side, my opponent doesn't exactly have a huge amount of pressure going on, and I get to brain geyser myself for four. That's pretty cool. And I get to resolve this moat, and then hopefully we win the game. Yes, hello. Where are you? Alder has taken it up to, taken up sitting on the my carpet that my uh chair is on uh and just sits between the legs like the or the wheels basically so if i move the chair i run the risk of running over my sweet baby um but she won't try to come up she'll just sit there and yell at me give me the like hey you're supposed to pick me up supposed to pick me up and, and, and give me a hug. You're supposed to give me scritches. I need scritches. I guess not pick you up. Oh, I'm going to burn for one. She just wants scritches, but in order for me to get to her, I got to like really kind of lean in. She just yells at me the entire time. It's great. You know what I don't have, but would really like to own? A Beta Shivam Dragon. I would really like to own one. A Sliver Queen. I'm actually working on that. I'm working on that. Somebody in the community reached out to me. Uh, and uh, we're going to work out a trade. Oh, I have a sick play. Red. Pump the Shivam Dragon up to nine. Boomerang my own Badlands. Play it as my land for the turn and then use it as a red source to pump up my dragon to ten. Boom. Magic the Gathering. And that was a dead end. I wonder what I could get a beta shot. What are you on, like, guard duty? Like, what are you doing? You want to come up? 
Let me find out. Let me let me pull up. No, not Facebook. What the fuck is a Facebook reel? I could. Oh. I assume Facebook Reel is is like the version, uh, like it's a TikTok or, or uh, whatever, uh, Instagram story kind of thing. Literally the first, I clicked on it and it was like, hey, check this out. And it, I believe that was a video of a cop about to shoot someone. <laughs> Pretty fucking cool. Eye rollers. I want actual high rollers. Beta Shivan Dragon. Ooh, is that a beta signed? That's an alpha signed mana barbs? Oh shit. That that's actually not that bad. No, that's a beta beta signed mana barbs by Chris Rush. 375 bucks. I can't do this. This is bad. This is I got I got a PC to buy. Mana barbs. M A N A B A R B S. I gotta, this is why I don't look at high-end stuff, because I just want to buy it. There's much better things. I got bills to pay. I don't need these magic cards. I do not need these magic cards. Off to a great start. Bills to pay, mouths to feed. <gasps> Is that a place set of beta juggernauts? 400 bucks. That's not bad. <laughs> Giant with your bat? All right. <clears throat> it's just more important things than buying a beta sheep and dragon. Oh, what is that, though? Huh? Hmm. Oh, I found one. Okay. <clears throat> Out of curiosity, I just found an LP beta sheep LP plus. Pretty pretty good condition. Oh, that's actually a good price on the Lord of Atlantis. Oh, uh, you can answer this too if you want. Uh, do you know what a Shivan Dragon is? It's like a bit the big. I don't know if he, I don't know if he likes that comparison. Um. Oh, I can't cast any of this shit. Uh. Take a gander at how much a LP plus Beta Shivan Dragon is. Chat. No peeking. Like, I couldn't mulligan this. 1200. Oh, 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 hello. What up, Grease? Oh, man. Yeah, I can't. I think I'm dead. If I draw a land, I can at least swords the spider. Hello. No, this is. Uh, 2.5. This is 3k. It's very good condition, but I don't know. I don't exactly want to spend 3k on uh, a card that just I think it looks really pretty. Right, the gloom. Back at 
at it again. Back at it again. This is so fucked. Uh, Pikeman. One. I clicked the one! Gloom. Yeah, it's a reserve list card. Oh. Uh, power of two. Why that's Rainbow Knights. Everybody's favorite totally real magic card. I'll go here. Volk. Mox. Ring. Hold up the four spike. Nice. <laughs> Three cards we can't cast. Super nice. Oh yeah, get in, get in a fourth, why not? Yeah, five, you know. Okay, plenty of blue mana. How do you go about purchasing expensive cards and amassing a collection? I currently have two duels that I purchased from my LGS, but I want to continue building my collection. There's a couple of ways that you can go about doing this. Uh, one, if you attend events like Magic Cons or Command Fests, there are going to be dealers there. Dealers uh, can buy... Base, they'll be, buy, you know, basically anything. So if you draft or win packs from like standard events or whatever, or just have a bunch of product, uh, you can cash those in for either credit or money and then use that to pick up cards either from the dealer or you can get it from other players. There are always people selling magic cards. There's always people selling cards. Um, <clears throat> and so, yeah, if you... I mean, you could look on, there are Twitter sellers, there are Facebook sellers, uh, 10, for a lot of these groups, there's tends to be like a verification process or references, especially with high end stuff. Often you're like, if you're buying from like a, a seller on, uh, on like a high end group, there will be some amount of like, Hey, here are my references. Like, uh, I'm not going to scam you, which is appreciated. Yeah. There are also websites that specialize in doing that kind of thing too. If you're really looking to get like rid of everything, then you're going to, or like like everything in the sense of uh, all the chaff, like stuff dealers won't even pick up. Um, then you are going to want to go through like a, a bigger box retail store. Um, like uh, SCG or, or, or Card Kingdom or whatever and uh, get yourself that way you can ship like everything you can turn bulk into duels and whatnot. Um, yeah a bunch of ways I have no white mana I really want to cast this Sarah Angel so I'm going to find my Black Lotus I think that's better than playing dragon because I can't dragon this turn. Yeah, no worries. Oh, fucking paralyze. I don't have white mana yet. What the hell is with your deck? What, what, what the fuck is your deck? Stop! Uh, 
I oh because of gloom oh Christ fucking figure it out I'm just dead. Um, they're at six. I mean, I can fissure my own angel. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So I can fissure and play trike. Glad I didn't play moat. All right, consider not bringing white cards. I I literally would run out of magic cards for the deck. Like I or die, I wouldn't have enough. Oh brother. Okay. Uh, yeah. Two. I hear you, Mulder. One, two, three. That dies. Drop of honey dies. No one. I die. Oh, we almost done this run. I've been bashing my head against this for the past hour and 30 minutes. Starting to think my deck is bad, but also this, this particular, uh, I, I, I need to get this out of the way because I genuinely believe that the blue one and the, the, the other castles are going to be so much easier. Uh, one in green or one green, three colors. That's Marsh Viper. Yeah. The other ones are going to be much easier. It's just this combination of gloom and then the card that they start you off with or that they start off with is uh, pretty, pretty bad news. Bad news bears. Uh, I'll fight you. Yeah, starting with carry ants is bad. Gloom is tough to play around. Because the ways that this deck actually just like accrues card advantage and kills the opponent is through the white cards. Like right now, I'd be able to set up a, a moat and then we're off to the races. But I can't because my moat costs seven mana. At least they are activating. Yeah, all right. On you lit. Sorceress Queen. I don't actually care about Sorceress Queen here. Uh, yeah, I cannot balance. I cannot disenchant the gloom. But I will at the first opportunity. What? Do you want up or not? You want up? What do you want here? What? Well, I gotta see what my cat wants. What?
I am back. I have given Mulder food. And I have brought myself some veggie soup. With white wine. Here we go. Having problems in the Black Castle seems like a skull issue. Okay, that was pretty good, Shiba. That was good. I'll give you that one. That was good. Oh. Hey, where'd your cards go? Where'd, your, where'd all your cards go? Of course, this is when they play the second Sanger Vampire, and then I'm kind of... Well, I got this removed soul. But then they play the third Sanger Vampire. <clears throat> oh, Jesus. Oh, yeah, that's soup. Give me a card. Let's go. <laughs> I feel good about this one. I feel like this is the time. This is it. Unsummon. Okay, this is, I think this is it. Force field, we can do better than that. We can do better than that. <clears throat> I need like a Sarah or a Mahamadi or a Sheevan Dragon or a something. Jade statue is not it. You only get the last one, you get 21 lives. Oh. oh, but the live stack. Ugh, fuck, that's not going to be enough. I mean, I'll, I'll check here. I guess I could check here. I really need a creature. All right, well, maybe, <coughs> maybe we're, maybe we're going to be fine. They, it's just a hypnotic spec. You mulligan that hand? Why? Okay. Oh. <laughs> 
had to do it turn one, huh? I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back. I, I can't. I can't keep doing this. We beat the red castle, the green castle. Where's the blue castle? All the way up there. We got to go to the white castle. I'm going to have to like tech my deck. Cause that's that's impossible. Holy shit. I don't need these cards, but White Castle, you rather you rather go to Denny's? Do you not have a Sherry's where you are? Because <clears throat> that's clearly the best. I have very strong memories about Sherry's. What's a Sherry's? Uh, I think it's like a Denny's style restaurant in the United States. Yeah, the banana cream dream. That's what I'm talking about. <clears throat> Your mainland BC? I mean, I'm island BC. I just know about cherries from magic trips down down south. Wait, no, I did want to do it. Holy armor. Holy armor. It works. The mute emote works. The system works. Oh, I could have maybe slapped a spirit link on it. I think I'm getting swords though. Potentially. I forget actually what the horse has. System works. 
good soup though. Real easy to make. And you can customize it. Oh, ho, 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 the four spice. Put whatever veggies you want. Doesn't matter. The white wine is going to solve everything. That's such like a white woman mentality. Don't worry, the white wine will solve everything. Scimitar. This is actually kind of fun. Why do you have a 1 5? Mm hmm. Why do I have a 1 5? I love the AI. Where's the white castle? It's up here. I'm at the Chandelier. I'm at the white castle. I'm at the white castle in Chandelier. I don't see you, dog. I don't see you, dog. I don't see you, dog. Karma is in effect? Okay. <clears throat> ah! Around every corner lies a horse. Mm, there's a dice there. There's a horse here. God, oh, there's so many winged creatures. I'm at the soup store. I don't see you, dog. Uh, root potato, welcome back for the 59th month. Nope. 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 Too many, too many months. Too many months. Oh, sure. The, the one time I have one of my swamps in play. And I tap the swamp to... Oh, I have to, I have to tap your karma? Behold, it's an onulent fight. <clears throat> Is it true there's an American chain called Soup Plantation? Like outside of the South? Because like, what the, what the hell's going on over there? Mind twist. Beautiful. Mm-hmm. Mm, mm-hmm. I don't know what pizza ranch is. Was that that incredibly gay one? I thought that was called, like, uh, Smash Ranch or something. 
egg slut why not well plantation tends to hold um a certain you know uh, uh, you know it's a bit much oh i have to divine offering this thing Do I have a plan for beating these soul nets? I need to slap a spirit link onto something or resolve a stream of life. An alabaster potion, anything at this point. Ooh, that's a good one. Oh shit, right. I drew the mox jet. I didn't need to play a second black source here. But it's okay. They only have one card in hand. Surely it's not sword supply shares. And I can Inferno for lethal? Yeah. I mean, I'll need to be a little careful. These soul nets are genuinely uh, a bit of a pain. Shit. Definitely kept the wrong land. Wait, what? <laughs> you just didn't do it? Didn't do anything? Maybe the, the AI doesn't want to block because they're worried about making this bigger. I shouldn't have attacked. They just lose to their own mana vault. But, you know, I kind of wanted to see what they would do. I'm not going to do that. The Pope is not the leader of this area. <clears throat> Demonic Tutor basically finds two kinds of cards. Uh, Black Lotus and uh, Flying Creature. No in-between. Contrast in some of these cards is unreal. Oh yeah, it's just a collection of the best cards of all time. And then uh <clears throat> a <laughs> just a, a uh what's it what's uh proof of concept of them just hating creatures. The cards are almost designed as if they were like annoyed that people were playing creatures. Like, you're like, oh, God, you want to play... What do you mean you want to play creatures? Don't do that. Why would you want to play creatures? Oh, the hive? Big yikes. 
That's uh, slightly smaller, yikes. All right, allergies are kicking up. Cherry blossoms of Victoria are starting to blossom. Ooh. Mm, you're tapped out. You're just a random priest. Uh, it's a schlep. But I'll go all the way back there if I need to. I don't actually know, but it is very disorienting. I'm glad somebody else mentioned it. The like decals on the floor. <clears throat> This hand's kind of cracked. Oh, never mind. Oh, we draw a black source. It's all right. Oh. oh. Onulet? Yeah. <laughs> Don't ever change. Don't ever change, Shondalar. Land Man of Old Onulet. Boosh. What are you going to do? Well, now you're just going to take one each turn because you had to have that onulet. You just, you just had to have that on you, didn't you? I told you. I told you not to buy that on you, but you just had to have that on you. You and you just had to go back for a second one. Opponent playing Mana Vault is the best win con in Shondalar. It's pretty good. It's pretty good at, you know, uh, getting your opponent to lose. Mind twist. Three Wrath of Gods in the Hive. Jesus, are you okay? Cry for help, ass ant. Oh, Mana Burn for one. Oh, they got an angel. Yeah, they do. Um, well, shit, they drew an angel. That was pretty bad. Oh, right, banding. Fuck. Uh, oh, crap. Oh. We forgot Mesa Pegasus is banding. Oh, the hive. Genuinely a bit of a pisser. Uh, let's twist her. What? Giant spider. I can disenchant the hive. I can disenchant Tetravis too. That's pretty good. I got a time walk going. I'm just going to fireball you for four. Oh, I skipped over combat. Great. Then I'm going to contract from below. No, oh, my Sarah Angel. I need that to actually win the game. I don't know if my Yoshin soldier is really going to be... 
Oh, I have a moat in play. Yeah, oh wait, fuck, I have a moat in play. I am not... This is... This might go poorly for me. I forgot I had moat in play. Hmm. Thank you. <laughs> oh, now my remove soul. I mean, I will remove soul this vultures. Big bet. I got fucking jabated. Oh. oh. Oh, you motherfucker. Oh. Well, I have more life than them. Oh, that's a good card. I got baited so hard. Uh, actually, Fissure might be better to cast here. Except into like exactly <clears throat> second, uh, second angel. I guess I can't angel and hive. Get in. There's the white wizard. There's Gandalf. Air elemental. All right, that's good enough. Sainted one has the spell war elephant. Two two trample banding. Pretty big. Oh. They put a blessing on their war elephant. I don't want to deal with any alchemy cards. That's a pretty good draw. We could die to this war elephant. <clears throat> and we just might, actually. There's no way I'm dying to this war elephant. Planes. A basic planes. All right, I'll give it one more shot, and then I'm turning it off of my sanity. Which does mean... There's a card called Blessing. Two mana enchantment. You can pay one enchanted creature gets bigger. Oh, Stone Giant. What the 
hell is going on here? Y'all having a party? I found Gandalf and we got a Sheev and Dragon. Okay. Okay. This is how we do it. Oh, this hand is un stone unplayable. Uh, Lantax actually, hold up. Lantax might be able to help us out. Uh, planes, mountain, and island, draw land, of course, as is customary. I have this drop of honey. Land tax, island mountain, place. Oh, I could have just hit them for seven twice. But I can also just kind of hit them and bolt. So it's fine. You cast Armageddon? Why did you cast Armageddon? <laughs> Why did you cast Armageddon? <laughs> okay. None of these are really worthwhile. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to call it there. This is... I have to rethink how I'm building my deck for that black castle. And I have I have received irreparable psychic damage from that. Um, yeah. I got to figure out what to do. Maybe there's a different build of this because that's like impossible. I I don't want it to necessarily be me just like re-rolling until I get a good, like good RNG. I want to at least like make an effort to build a deck in a way that could, you know, try to combat that without it necessarily being just a, a crapshoot. Uh, so I'm going to call it there. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, the schedule is not up on the Discord yet. It's going to be up basically as soon as I turn off the stream. Um, but I am not doing a home stream tomorrow because we're recording North 100 Showdown. And I'm on the, um, the, the AFK. We're doing a Lorcana draft and all that uh, tomorrow. So, and something secret that I can't talk about. But uh, busy, busy Ben. The schedule will be up. All the information will be there on the Discord. You can look into. Um... Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. I'm going to drop you kids off somewhere. I just don't know where. Yes, indeed. A Canadian Highlander. Throw down. 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 Uh, nobody I know is streaming. 
Matt is streaming. Yeah, go say hi to Wiggins. I feel like I haven't raided Wiggins in a hot minute. Maybe it's because my schedule changed. When I was streaming the evening, we could stream Matt much easier. Is Matt just watching himself play? What is going on here? You can go watch Matt and I'll see y'all not. Well, I'll see y'all tomorrow if you tune in to Bloody Gritty Run. But if not, then then I'll see you on Tuesday. Okay, bye.